leadership that the Rockets have will rub off on him as a player, which will help them improve. Yeah, that's exactly right, Craig. And I think now that he's on a team that's actually playing for something that's going to be winning games, it's oh, oh, oh yeah, nice defense. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> I'm a little disappointed. Well, he did hang the net, but that but he's got unbelievable springs. And as a young player, he's got uh, the ability now to play with the Rockets and, and let them use his skills to his advantage. He was the eighth overall pick in 2016, originally by Sacramento's hometown team. We're talking. He came here to Houston and realized how much space there was to operate on the offensive end. So nice. Job of adjusting to that. I know Clyde's talking about Philadelphia and Boston. Indiana might sneak in there. They're a good team. They're very physical. That's his shot. He can make corner three, so he's like Clint Capella, except he does have a three-point shot. That steal late in the game in Birmingham. He was hard to score on all the way down the court. That's pretty easy by Darren Collison. You forget about Darren a little bit, but he also had a comeback season last year. They got a lot of UCLA exits in this lineup. Tilting against the defenders, for sure. Yeah, if you score 131 points like the Rockies did a couple of nights ago, you're going to win every game.